Hey y'all, welcome back to Inside the Barrel. I'm Double J. I'm Big H. I'm Nathan. Nate Dog. Nate Dog. All right. So this one's going to be kind of fun. I was in Colorado visiting my dad. Oh. And I was in the whiskey aisle and saw something I've never seen before. Decided not to buy it because I was flying home. So I made my dad drive from Colorado to Illinois with this bottle. So shout out. Shout out my dad. Thank you, Mr. Campbell. Thanks, Mr. Thanks, Dad. Thanks. Thanks, Dad. Very nice of you. Mr. Dog. But it, but it's it's weird. Thank you, Mr. <clears throat> Nate Dog. We appreciate that immensely. <laughs> Mr. Dog, thanks. <laughs> so it's weird. It doesn't look like our traditional whiskey, does it? Bring it in there. So what happened is probably one of the greatest marketing companies ever, Paps Blue Ribbon. Whoa! I, wait. <clears throat> yeah. Look at here, folks. Hey, just for Double that. J always has a warm up during these episodes with Paps Blue Ribbon. So, Paps, you get us through the episode, and now you've come up with this. But, greatest marketing people ever. They do such a good job. They actually called the Alcohol and Tobacco uh, Trade and Tax Bureau and said, How long do we have to age, age right. basically, moonshine to be classified as a whiskey, not a moonshine? And they, no one's ever asked that question. It, there's no amount of time that it has to be aged. It just has to be aged. So they stamped even right here on the uh, label, aged five seconds. They, they've they aged it five seconds, so now they can call it whiskey, put it in the whiskey aisle, and give it to us to review on our whiskey review show. So. We got a barrel pop? I mean, a bottle pop? Ooh, Ooh, that's really nice. Good <laughs> one. Job. Really good one. Yeah. So, got to be careful when I pour this, this, because, yeah. That, that looks like. So don't don't be afraid of this like it's no, I'm not afraid of it. That's it's it's that super sweet. The proof it's oh, only it's only eighty there. proof. It's only eighty proof. It's 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 more water than it is. So it's gonna be else. Mild. it's gonna be a mild one sixty whiskey. Eighty proof. If you guys are wondering, it was on it was twenty dollars, but again, thanks dad, he bought it and, and brought it over. It cost him way more to drive it over than the bottle did. Um but the mash bill is very similar to a bourbon. It's 52% corn, 27% barley, 17% um, uh, I can't oh 17% wheat and 4% rye. So it's actually a four grain mash bill, very complex four grain <coughs> mash bill. Um, also, it should be noted that this is done in collaboration with New Holland Distillery yeah. in, in Michigan. In Michigan, okay. Yeah. So they they do some bourbons up there. Um, they're also known for beers as well. Absolutely. So, a lot of talking on this one. Oh, yeah. Shout out. No. Yeah. Where are they? Right here. Well, Michigan would be like this because there's. Let's see what you can tell is. Yeah. Over New Holland Brewery over here. Okay. Let's try this. Ooh. So all all bourbon starts <laughs> out <laughs> looking <laughs> like this when it goes in the barrel. Mm. Until, yeah, yeah. yeah, right. And the, and right. the aging is actually what the, gives it. Yeah, the, the color. barrel aging is what gives it the color. That's why after five seconds you don't get much. It's right. light. It's sweet. Very there's light. A, there's a lot of fruit on there. Lighter fruits like peaches and apples and like a crisp. I don't apple. smell any oh. apple and peaches okay. and well, plums it's light and berries. Fruit. It's not red fruit. Yeah, it's grapes. Plums, grapes. <laughs> All right. Very light. Hmm. Nothing to that. That could sneak up on you there. Well, it's 80 proof, so it'd take a little bit more to sneak up. Yeah. Uh, it for me, it tastes like it looks. Yeah, I, I think, think I'm just gonna stick. I'm just gonna stick with my beer. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's okay. It could. It could probably be mixed with something. And at a twenty dollar price point, I think that's what you expect. There's no way we should be drinking yeah. this out of Glen Claren. No, I love the nose. Um, it's it's kind of short. It's short on taste, oh. and then really short on finish. You just there's no there's really no finish. It just dies. Yeah. yeah, it's fun. It's cool. The biggest thing about it was the age five seconds thing. How they kind of beat the law on being classified as a whiskey. I don't think anyone's going to take them as a serious whiskey because of this coloring and because it's five seconds as compared <clears throat> to the years. That we're used to doing. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> do you got is 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 this okay? No, we're good. <laughs> okay. We're good. Um, That's all. The dog's Shoulders about to jump, jump, bro. Dog's about to jump. Stop. Off. Do- Harry watches us. Good, 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 boy. good job. Okay. Harry. Stay ready. Give us a rating. I, I'm gonna give it a, a two point eight. <laughs> two point eight. Two point eight. For it, the price, I think it's fun to put on the bar. 
Oh, so you're going to put that one on the bar? No. <laughs> for, for $20, it is a cool story to talk about. Yeah. It's PBR. Everybody knows PBR. Yeah. So, I don't know. I'd be afraid if, you know, the kids came over, if any kids were to come over. They don't come over here. Like PBR. Your kids? <laughs> Man, my kids. Well, my, his, my 23 year old yeah, son. His kids He are drinks PBR, old. I'm sure. So, whatever. Anyway. Anyways. Thanks, y'all. We appreciate it. Like, subscribe. Sh please share. Please, please share. share. Yeah. Check out the, I don't know if we'll post videos at the end of this or not, but. Too little.